name's Stephanie Sparks and at the college I'm a life skills support mentor and I'm recently nominated as a Young Carers Champion. I started in September last year and I have known um, a couple of the workers at, for the Torbay Young Adult Carers Service for over 10 years now and when I first started I um, presented my journey at the college and I was quite open about my caring role as well to the students. Um, I found that a lot of the students started to approach me about their caring roles which uh, created a welcoming atmosphere for us all to talk about what we do at home and Torbay Young Adult Carers Service of course have been supporting uh, the college for over 10 years now and as well as South Devon College the student carers uh, but what we've got in place now is uh, guidelines for staff and for the student carers uh, to follow so they're accessible on the Moodle course. Uh, what this allows is for everybody to be on the same page and to also they're informative so it gives you a little bit of uh, background into what a student carer might have to go through and what support is accessible to them within the college and making sure that they work together with their tutor. The other things we have in place are surveys so they are already in place but the questions have become more specific to the carer so asking them if they have a caring responsibility because that aim is to make sure that they're signposted to the correct service for them. Um, and then also we have our Caring for Carers survey which is accessible all year round for carers to give feedback. Uh, so this will allow us to improve any support for the carer um, and make sure that they have uh, the resources that they might need if they need to study from home and so forth. Uh, we've also got our Moodle course online. Um, it says do you care for somebody else and it's got a purple background. Click onto that and they can enrol onto that course. Uh, there's the services on there, uh, food services, uh, we've got the feedback that you can find on there and much, much more. Even videos to help uh, carers know like how a CT scan works if they have to take their care into hospital. We've got the student card that you can use uh, with your tutor. Uh, so if you're struggling to communicate your needs, you can just let them know um, if you work together what things you might need. So you might need to take an emergency call extra time with your work and your tutor will understand and be flexible to your needs. And we have the SD Connect group. So if you, uh, at the end, my mobile and email will be provided. Um, that group is for young adult carers to, uh, you can chat on there and there's different bits of news, updates. And um, if you ask me for the password, I can provide that so that we just create a safe group for carers to go. Other developments are in place. What we'll do is continue to look at things that might need to be improved like a space for the students to go. So we'll keep you updated by Moodle and ST Connect and we're always interested in your uh, feedback as well uh, because we'll use that to make sure that we make these improvements to give everybody a good experience. Yeah, I feel very proud um, that we've worked with so many people within the college across different departments. There's eight criteria to cover to ensure that we close all the gaps and make sure that the student carers are getting the best um, experience whilst in education and importantly keeping our carers in education and letting them know that we are all here to support them and grow together to make sure that um, they get the best experiences from their courses and importantly with the accreditation um, the support doesn't just finish there when the students finish their courses we continue to stay in touch and see what destinations uh, carers have ended up in and also the Torbay Young Adult Carers Services or any other service they're appointed to depending on the area we will continue to uh, make sure they get that support and activities and breaks and so forth. Thank you for listening and I look forward to meeting all of the student carers and my contact details can be found at the end of this video.